I can be a bully. If Nora thinks I'm a bully to her, then so be it. If I don't like you, I can bully you. Ha! I can be a bully. If Nora thinks I'm a bully to her, so be it. I don't like you, but I can be a bully. Cha! Yabo Jo Queen Mother. Yabo Jo Queen Mother. I like Yabo Jo on that uh, Lagos Housewife. Is that the the show? Let's guess Lagos Housewife. That show, I honestly I like Yabo Jo. And for those of you who are blasting Yabo Jo on that show, you forget the main purpose of those show is to create content, is to bring out yourself so that the show can go on to season the next season and also the next season and also the other season so that all of them they can all come together to make money. I don't understand why you should be holding grievances in your heart, but obviously that statement make Yabo Ojo make uh, she wasn't supposed to make it, honestly. But you know, when the camera constantly are on your face, one day, one day, you will break. You will break and show your true color. And Queen Mother actually did show a true color. I do not know, maybe that's not a true color, but she indeed showed a true color. Ah. You can be a bully, and if you don't like person, you don't deal with them with that. Ah, uh, that was so hard show. And meanwhile, of course, you were seeking for justice for Mobad, crying, begging, oh, for justice for Mobad. Came online and made how many video, more than an hour video, trying to talk for justice for Mobad. Ah, a bah. Justice for Mubad, and meanwhile, you are doing the exact thing you claim that Amalia and Samlari did to Mubad. So, if you see, you cannot beat somebody with this hand and pet the other person with this hand, eh? you can't. This is who you are, you cannot form who, who you are not. That is to say. Naramani and Samlari in Iyabo Ojo's book, if we should look at Iyabo Ojo's book with what is she said, that is to say exactly what Naramani and Samlari did to Mubad, they were absolutely correct. Because according to Iyabo Ojo, if you do not like someone, you can do whatever you need with that someone, make that person's life unbearable. Yes, that's what, what she said. That what she said. Exactly what she said. And they should have edited that part out. But the bill I say, they know why I did them out. They say, you see, you must chop your own breakfast today, Yabojo. So according to Laura, Laura said, the worst thing that can happen to a mother is to see a child being bullied. I know it will crush me to see that happen to any of my children. It is not, it is okay not to like person. It is okay to keep your distance. But please, I'm begging you, it's not okay to bully anyone. Nothing about bullying is cool. Let's do better. You know, <laughs> you know, that's not around. Very, very nice because Yabo Ojo was referring to her. It's okay. See. Obviously, I think we should stop that mentality that if you don't like someone, we deal with that person, make life unbearable for that person, close that person jobs, bite, bite that person, lie against that person just to make sure that person will ruin that person's life and everything. It is okay to hate, to not like someone, but give distance. I absolutely, absolutely disagree. With your about you. But what what is the show all, all about though? The show is all about the closing and everything. And I do not sure if the show was scripted. Yes, so I'm not sure. I'm not sure if that show was scripted. 
Because if it was scripted, then they would have found a way to kind of like, you know, put it and uh, uh, edit it. And uh, maybe Yaba Ojo will say, oh, you know what? I cannot say this because this is what I stand for. But it wasn't scripted. It was from the heart. Few of the things in the show were scripted, but such statement wasn't scripted. It was I don't think it was scripted. Ah! Ah, wow! Yabo Ojo, fighting for Mubad, and yet want to make someone laugh on Biarico. Yabo Ojo, you know, trial. Then, Ola Dips trying very hard to prove to people that he was actually dead for two to three days. <laughs> he was confirmed or responsive for two to three days, according to Ola Dips. <sighs> then, he is trying as much as possible to fight people who said he was alive. They say you are alive. You don't go thank God. Why are you fighting people? Why are you doing interviews? Trying to prove to the world that you were dead. Ah, God, make God don't let us. They do interview waka waka to prove to the world, say we buy. God, that bear. Which kind of work be that? What kind of stress? What kind of work we make a man? We be going from one radio station to another stranger station to prove to the world that he actually buy. When people said you are alive, thank God and I am to the lie that you are alive. So, ah, no, 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 no. This uh, this uh, internet something is getting into some people's head. Eh? They need to slow down a bit. You know, trying to make it through the internet, trying to make sure people like you, trying to do this. It's getting to your head, Ola Dips. Ola Dips, you don't need to prove to anybody. It's even disgraceful. Wishing yourself so many atrocities. Come on, man. It's crazy. Obviously and honestly, really, really crazy. Really, really crazy. Ah, Papa. May you chill now. Chill. Guy. Well, let's talk about a Nigeria, some Nigeria policemen who were laid. Yes, let me use that word. Were laid, a foreigner that was traveling on her bike. How are you? Hello. Hello. How is everything? Everything is fine. From where? Netherlands. Eh? Netherlands. Where you the car? What do you bring car? <laughs> See the that? Eh? Oh, you give me a Where they go? Abuja. Abuja? Uh. See. How are you? Give me something. How is for everything? Everything is fine. Family. Huh? How is family? Good. Family is good. <laughs> This water. Yeah. Me, 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 yeah, what do you bring? Like... Wait till you bring come. Huh? Wait till, wait till you bring come. I say wait till you bring come. Wait till you won't give me. <laughs> hey. Wait till now. Wait till you won't give me. Oh yeah, give me something. Oh yeah, give me something now. Give me uh, something. <laughs> you give me something. Yeah. <laughs> I, give me money. Sir? Money. 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 Yeah. Why? Give me. You know, uh, it's so disgraceful. Uh, Nigeria police are like, hey, ah, acting shock. Why are you guys acting shock or crying out loud? What do you see they are on a daily basis? Hey, you did that. The IGP people, hey, you did that. What are you guys acting shock for? These things happen on a daily basis. Every minute, the person they give policeman money for Nigeria. Every minute. 
In fact, it's very simple in seconds. Someone somewhere in Nigeria is giving police my money. A foreigner. He post, this foreigner posted it on our official YouTube page. Further destroying the name of Nigeria police. And you're going to blame her for documenting what she saw, what she encountered while traveling. Why is it that the only gesture the Nigeria police at that time had to make is give me something? Oh, give me something. It's how they have water. It's not give me something. You give me something. Give money, 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 money. Uh uh. And these are the same police persons, eh? police personnel. If Nigerians, youth, start revolting, asking for better pay to them, <laughs> this is Nigerian police, eh? go carry chair gas, go chair gas your life. <laughs> the high road they about this like this Nigeria, eh? the world there, eh? I don't understand. I don't understand. I don't understand. People fighting for your right. You go meet them. Slap. Why are you fighting for my right? <laughs> you chair gas them. Chair gas student. Chair gas them. <laughs> Ah, oh, god damn it. Ah, uh, oh, god damn it, man. The cruise over this god, uh, the cruise is, is alarming. Ah, <laughs> oh, god.